Prevention is better than cure. A very old saying, yet a very useful one. Through this video, I, Dr. Payal, your own physical therapist, would like to educate you how to prevent your knee from early osteoarthritis and if you have already been diagnosed with osteoarthritis, what steps to be taken. So we'll learn prevention as well as cure for knee osteoarthritis. Keep regular check on your weight as overweight increases load on the knee joint. Keep regular check on your vitamin and mineral levels as lack of these nutrition can cause muscle and joint weakness. Exercise regularly to keep your joints and muscles strong. Encourage cross leg sitting, kneeling as in Vajrasan pose, staircase usage and squatting in day-to-day -day activities to keep your knee joint active and strong. Last and the most important one, avoid overstraining your knee joint when in pain. Visit your surgeon or physiotherapist when symptoms are less rather than gulping a self-prescribed painkiller. Osteoarthritis is a progressive condition which means it is irreversible once diagnosed but you can definitely delay its progression. Now comes the billion dollar question. How do we slow down the progression of osteoarthritis? Well, let us check the symptoms of osteoarthritis with its cure. First symptom that we see in osteoarthritis is pain in and around the knee joint. Electrotherapeutic modalities like IFT, TENS, ultrasound, etc. given by a licensed physiotherapist can help ease out the pain. Pain relieving medicines prescribed by a medical practitioner can help to reduce the pain. The second symptom that we see is swelling in and around the knee joint. Apply ice pack daily for 10 minutes. Elevation of the leg with the help of pillows during sleep. Use of knee caps or knee braces during activities. And if the knee is overstrained, rest can also help to reduce swelling. Third symptom, cracking noise or stiffness in the knee joint. To avoid stiffness after long hours of sitting or sleeping, it is advisable to do some knee or ankle movements before starting to walk. Gentle massage with oil in and around the knee joint can help reduce stiffness. Fourth symptom, incorrect postures. If you are suffering from prolonged heel pain or back pain, it can ultimately lead to incorrect postures that puts extra pressure on the knee joint, making it more prone to osteoarthritis. So take proper timely treatment for other affected areas. Last symptom that we see is lack of movement or imbalance. Due to pain, swelling and stiffness, the movement of the joint reduces, leading to muscle weakness and imbalance. Physiotherapy exercises practiced under proper supervision helps to reduce all the above symptoms 
and also increases joint mobility and muscle strength which eventually delays the progression of osteoarthritis. Hope this video benefited. In my next video, I will demonstrate to you the physiotherapy exercises that are important to keep your knee joint healthy and happy. Till then, take very good care of yourself, eat happily, smile fully and move correctly. Hello everyone, if you like my video, please press on the like button. If you have any queries related to knee osteoarthritis, please mention in the comment box below. Subscribe to my channel to get regular updates and share with your relatives and friends.